Hello again and welcome to another video from me Mr Arnold. Uh, this video we're going to look at the angle bisector. Again it's another one of the constructions we need for our GCSE and it's um, it's fairly straightforward so uh, let's just get straight to it and um, bisect this angle. Uh, just in case you're wondering, bisect means to cut it in half so I, whatever this angle here is I want to draw a straight line in such a fashion that it actually cuts the angle exactly in half. Um, I'm just going to start by measuring the angle just to see roughly how big it is and what we're dealing with. So if I use my protractor here, I make it that this angle is roughly around, let me see, 56 degrees. So the angle is 56 degrees. When we're finished, we should get an angle of around 28 degrees on both sides. So let's see how it goes. So start by taking a compass. Take a compass and you want to open up your compass so it's roughly around half of the line. So roughly around half the line. And what we're going to do is we're going to draw an arc. Draw an arc on my line and without changing the distance bef between the compass needle and the pencil, you're going to turn your compass around and draw an arc on the other line. That's step one. Step two, take your compass and put it on one of the arcs. And what you're going to do now is draw a second arc out here. Move your compass to the other arc that you drew earlier and draw another arc. So that the two arcs that you've drawn cross each other. Take away your compass, don't need that anymore, and take out your ruler. Take out your ruler and from the center of the angle we want to line it up with where my arcs crossed and we're going to draw a straight line so draw a straight line from the center of your angle straight up to where your arcs crossed now let's just check and see that we've done this correctly it was 56 degrees so I'm hoping that both angles are roughly around 28 degrees in the exam you do get a little bit of leeway but let's just check and see how we did so lining it up I make that angle around about 29 degrees we were hoping for 28 but that's not too bad and let's just check this one I make this yeah roughly around 29 degrees as well so the angle has been bisected and that's all there is to it. You'll find that these two angles are identical. They were both 29 degrees each. And that's how we bisect an angle. Thanks for watching and um, I'll see you again sometime.